What's up, and how's life? It's Nick, back with another episode. Um, we used to be getting $30,000 in income, but now we only have, like, we're losing 7000 So, we made a pretty big jump there when we made this area. It's so mostly because of these parks and universities. So, we need to make more buildings and zone more places to gain more money. As you can see, we're losing about $8,000 a week. I think that's how they measure it, per week. So we need to prevent that from happening any longer. Yeah, I accidentally set this whole district on fire last episode. That's not exactly a good thing. Yeah, that looks very strange. So we need to think, how are we going to transfer this into city? This is going to be more like suburbs here, so we just need to make a, a, like a small office area. We can't let it go on for too long. So we would have to get that going I like the idea of continuing this road cuz it started it started way wait where did it start started like this. Does this road naming mod still work? I've had this for a while now. What if I click on... How do I use this thing? If I were to say... Oh, and let me just put set. Okay. Road name. Let's just say Broadway. It's definitely on a small scale. I wish it was kind of bigger. Oh my god, look at all that fire. And that is why we are glitching out. Every time I try to go near here, we glitch out. Meanwhile, we'll just be working here. I want to check, is my gra how, how is my graphics card even handling this? Um, my graphics card load is only 15%. Temperature 60 Celsius. CPU load 56%. 38, 36 degrees Celsius. Okay, um, that's the CAM software from NZXT. I do have the Kraken in my build. So let's work on this.
So that's pretty good. I don't know exactly why I'm doing this, but it's interesting, I suppose. Let's zone this up with offices. There we go. Just some commercial there, I guess. Um, this is interesting, I guess. Definitely interesting. See, I can also make them all upgrade at once. Anyway. There's going to be some small apartments there. There's another district. And there's another district, and then there's going to be a smaller district there. We'll probably extend over to there. Um, I'm not sure exactly where we're going because I know the big city, like d downtown, is going to be there. This is going to be the financial area. This is going to be another dense area, but it's not going to be the actual huge city. What if I were to tell you all to upgrade, and you all to upgrade, and you guys all to upgrade? I wonder what would happen. Will they complain about low land value? Wow, that's... That's something. They do need high land value, though, to sustain this level. I 
I don't know. I'm just doing this because it'll make it look more like a city, I guess. And hopefully they don't complain about land value. At least we're getting money here. We're gaining money. Actually, we were for a second. Just piping it up here so we can continue working on our on the city. There you go. There we go. I'm just going over here because these guys don't have very high land value. That's not bad. Okay, I don't even know why I'm doing this. I should probably stop. It's just gonna kind of do bad, but it may do bad. I remember I did it in my last city too much, and then my it was just horrible. It's kind of cheating. Other than that, not that bad. All mods are in some way cheating, if you want to choose to think about it that way. Wait a second. This is going to be mostly high density residential. There we go. So we need some nice parks here to get the leisure levels high. Um, where is the stadium going to be, though? I think it should be here. Yeah, I think the stadium's going to be here. By stadium, I mean something like 
don't know exactly where it is. I don't know why I placed that. I'll just leave it there. So there's going to be a section of suburbs here, and then it's going to go into bigger city. Like, this is a whole other city over here. Let's look at it from the this point of view. See, that looks pretty cool. And this map is so big. We Like, this 81 Tiles mod, I'm going to fill up this whole map in some way. Not every place is going to be dense, but gonna be pretty cool. Okay, so I would say let's get transitioning into suburban There, that's okay, I guess. Um, so yeah, this is gonna be a little bit of a there, kind of like a maze. You could probably get stuck driving in there, but that's okay. There we go, that's not bad. Um, let's get some parks, though. And then we can start zoning. So this is going to be still some high density. That's good. Um, low density residential. Low density residential zone. Evolve into fancy villas. Interesting way to put that. Um, my computer's handling this pretty well. The city pretty well. Um, I don't know if it's going to be any different when we fill it up with 81 tiles. Like, all the 81 tiles. Because I have plans, like, a few towns on this island, big city here, suburbs here, a few scattered towns, and then more suburbs, or farming, or forestry here, forestry up here, probably. Um, 
this I may leave, like, I don't know if either of these will be un unpopulated, but one of them might have a little something, I don't know. Look at that, all three lanes filled. That's pretty rare right there. Of course, they're merging up ahead, but still. That's like a realistic, real-life traffic jam. Until you get to this point, in which they merge very stupidly. But it does look pretty cool. All our traffic problems, I mean, there's not many traffic problems here. Yeah. Our city's doing pretty good in terms of traffic. This area used to be, like, always jammed up, especially right here. But now it's so nice. After this episode, I'm going to try to upload all my videos because I know I'm kind of behind on that. And I need to get up to date with my videos. Houses... There you go. Ploppable Rico. Yeah, I reinstalled this mod. Should be working so much better now. Yeah, this looks pretty affected by fire. I wonder how long it'll take for them to recover. Um, it looks like we're having a lot of trash problems. Not exactly sure why, however, I guess we could do with a few more. So this is where we'll have kind of a another facility. I don't care if they overlap each other. So this should now be like be used by a lot of garbage trucks over here. I just hope it doesn't cause that many traffic problems. Go garbage trucks. Go garbage trucks. Okay, so we have this area all fixed up nicely. I think in the next episode we're going to work on this chunk. So, yeah, that'll, that'll be good. Wait a second, did I just see that we're losing $69,000? Um... That's interesting. Could we raise taxes without getting people too mad? 
I don't even know how to get to that. Um. How do you get to the budget here? Where is the budget panel? Do I really not even know how to get to the budget panel? Our population's even going down. What's happening here? to get to the budget panel. I that's weird. I actually forgot how to get to the budget panel. How do I get to the budget panel? City statistics. We are almost at 120,000. Then we came down. Birth rate. We don't have any available jobs. That's death rate I don't even know how to get to the city budget that's not very good is okay taxes could we put it up to 10% without getting people mad that should expenses Total, that's our total money. All right, our income's slowly going up. Budget. Um... Not sure. Loans? I don't want any loans. Um, seems to be going up a little bit better. We just need houses. To generate more income. And that looks like a pretty big spot for houses. Probably like the closest building to the edge of the map. Just experiencing a little bit of a money problem here, but not that bad. OK. 
Okay, I, I need to turn straight slope off because that's messing everything up. Yeah, they need water. Water is good. forgot about this connection over here. We could definitely use that, I guess. So, these rows are just a layout for this area. Um, that's the, those are the roads for our new area, but for this episode, well, that's going to be it. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.